Hey, good morning, fish heads. Jen Cravasi with a real quick update for you guys. Should take less than a minute, I think. I might have to put this together and put it into a video, but hopefully we'll be able to scoot through it. So yesterday, which would have been Wednesday, the 12th of August, I asked you guys for a couple of numbers, and there are some reasons behind that. So let's go to the Facebook page. Hopefully you guys are in frame and you can see everything that's happening. And we're going to pull this down until we get to the right one. Still loading, loading. Dun, dun, dun. How's everybody doing this morning? Hopefully well. Okay, I asked you guys for a number between 33 and 672, followed up with a number between 1 and 6. There were 104 comments. So we're going to click on the 104 comments, previous comments. We're going to get all the comments together. Now, not all of these are actual comments. And I'm saying that because there's a couple, like there's responses. So on responses, you guys are going to watch me do this. There's a delete. Um, this is not an actual response, although Andrew did um, put in an actual number and you can see that there. Um, if there's any repeats, I'm going to delete. If there's more than, like if one person did a couple of them, I have to delete that. Um, Seamus, look at the trust you have. You ask for something and like train mice, we all jump and just do it. Um, there, but it, yeah, it's going to be fun though. So let me delete that one. Come on now. Delete. Delete. Okay. And I think I responded to a couple of them. Um, this can be deleted. Yes, delete the comment. There were a few of you that wanted 666 and 6. But you'll see. You'll see why. And if you win the lottery. Well, actually, it might be you guys winning a lottery of sorts. Because here's what's going to happen while I'm going through and deleting these comments. Let me kind of clue you in. So I told you the other day that I had been rereading this atlas of uh, freshwater fish from Dr. Herbert Axelrod. And he's one of my favorite um, biologists, photographers. I've, I've kind of studied his work through uh, ichthyology for a very long time. And I'm, I'm a nerd like that, I guess. So um, what I want to do with you guys is I'm going to do a randomizer here and I'm going to pick one of these comments, one of them. Um, and what's going to happen is I'm going to open up this book, which has more than 672 pages. However, um, only the pages that I mentioned have six frames of fish on them. So each page has got six frames of fish, which is pretty cool. So JT, I'm going to give you six instead of seven. I, I know I don't think it was intentional. Anyways, we're going to we're going to do six if you do win. Um, not that one. We'll just delete this one. And not everybody that played along was a fish head. So in this book of lots of pages of pictures of freshwater fish, it is this book. I'm going to do a randomizer number when we refresh the page and then we'll open it to that page and on those pages you'll see frames of fish. So whoever wins that picture is either going to get a lure or I'm going to do a watercolor painting. If you guys are fish heads, I'll give you a lure. I'll paint it on camera in a spray session. And if you don't want the lure and you'd prefer a watercolor, then I will do an original watercolor for you guys. So that is what the deal is. Um, there was, where was Brian's? I think there was one in here somewhere where he said, hmm, but I don't, ah, there it is. Unfortunately, Brian, that can't be counted. So I'm gonna have to delete that because it's not a legit number and page. Okay, so let's refresh this page. 
And let's see how many comments we have now. And then we're going to do a randomizer. And one of you guys is either going to win a watercolor or a lure of whatever page we pop open. Okay, 90, okay, 93 comments. There we go. Maybe it just took a second to refresh itself. 93 original comments. Matt from Dead Meat is comment number one. And yes, you are eligible. Timothy Fry is comment number 93, the last one. Okay, let's do a randomizer. Random number generator. Okay, between 1 and 93, we're about to pick our winner. Where's that drum roll? Forty-seven. There it is. Actually, let me give you a close-up. Between one and ninety-three, the winner is number forty-seven. Who is number forty-seven? You guys are going to count with me. Ta-da! Ta-da! All right. Matt's number one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Bob Taylor is eight. Rob Taylor. Mark Allwine is nine. Jerry is ten. That's correct. So then we have Robin, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Scott Crawford is 20. That was correct. So James is 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Donovan is 31. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. Bernie, getting close. 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, Jimmy Watson, page number 505, frame one. 505, frame one, Jimmy Watson, you are winner, winner, chicken dinner. And we'll get that going for you. Now, I am going to cut this off and reframe it on the desk so you guys can see in good light which fish I'm going to be painting on camera because I have no idea. Um, this is actually going to be really fun. Um, okay, let's see what you've won, Jimmy. We are over at the finishing desk. This is the book I was talking about. And as you can see, it's got lots of awesome pages in it. We are going to find page 505, which is what Jimmy Watson asked for. Five oh five. Nope. Where did we go? Five oh five. We're almost there. Ah! Ha ha! Five oh five on the first frame. Right here. This is a Danio. Oh, that's gonna be a cool one. Okay. You have got Brachy Danio Nigra Fasciatus, which is a Danio. Very cool. Almost got the long finned danio but you do have a danio that's going to be a really cool fish to paint so jimmy the choice is yours i'm probably going to do both just because um we'll do a watercolor of this danio and we'll put it on a lure and i'm thinking jerk bait would be cool um yeah so congratulations jimmy watson Woo! you won this prize see ya